the, the job of Attorney General Stein is he's a chief officer of public safety in the state of North Carolina for all citizens. Catherine Truett's job is the CEO, the executive, if you will, of all the public schools. Why the hell are they stepping outside of their role and condemning parents for uh, violence and hostility? Nancy, the real violence and hostility is here. We've got an extraordinary case at Olympic High School in Charlotte where a boy was charged, a 15 year old boy was charged with forcibly raping, kidnapping, and beating the hell out of another a girl student. Check this out. He was allowed, Nancy, to play football with an ankle monitor on. Talk about a slap in the face to the victims. And then we find out also from Olympic High School, another uh, child also was uh, committing a felony, was charged with a felony, and was also allowed to play football uh, for Olympic High School. This is in Charlotte. And oh, by the way, at Olympic High School, in solidarity, uh, with the rape victim. I mean, this is atrocious. Female athletes at Olympic High School, in solidarity, they uh, skipped school for one day, or actually they went, they protested, excuse me, in school. They were all suspended. You got a girl raped, girls protesting. The boys get to play, uh, get to play sports. The superintendent, Winston, in Charlotte Mecklenburg school system, uh, he was like, meh, the girls broke the rules. What do you want? Neither Stein, nor Cooper, nor Truett can claim white supremacy or a lack of equality or to blame. Let me tell you why. The victims, well, the victims I'm talking about, the victims, they're black, they're Hispanic, they're white, they're boys and they're girls, but they're united. They're united by one thing, and that is this, that they're all the victims of a treacherously unsafe public school system that is managed by out of touch elites who are demagogues and who want to change the subject. So this has nothing to do. And if you think that uh, blaming people for racism or teachers for uh, being racist or whatever is going to cut it here, it ain't going to cut it.